Hello and welcome back to Zebra's Dev Bytes. In this video, I'm going to talk about using the EMDK Profile Manager in Android Studio to utilize mobility extensions on your Zebra device. For the purposes of this demo, I'm going to use Wi-Fi Manager to enable my device's Wi-Fi and then connect to my network. Firstly, please make sure you've downloaded and installed the EMDK for Android Studio plugin. I will provide a link in the description below if you haven't downloaded it already. Once you are installed and set up, create a new Android Studio project or open an existing one and make sure you've included the EMDK in your project. Also, don't forget to include your EMDK permission and library reference in your manifest. From here, select EMDK from the top toolbar and select Profile Manager. As you can see, I've already created a profile. I'm just going to click Edit here so I can show you all the many different features Profile Manager offers you to utilize your device. Make sure you use an MX version lower than your target device or the same as, and make sure your device has the desired MX functionality, or the project won't work. So for this demo purposes, I've just selected the Wi-Fi manager. I want to get it to enable my Wi-Fi, add a new network, and I'm just going to give it the name of the network as well as the password. From there, I can click Apply and Finish, and it should have generated an XML file under, called EMDK config under Assets. If we check it here, you can see that the profile name enable Wi-Fi has been created, so we can assume that it's all correct. The next step is to implement the EMDK listener interface to get our EMDK manager. So we need to do that and generate the methods for it. From here, in the unopened callback method, we can use our EMDK manager to get our profile manager instance. Once we've done this, and getting the profile manager instance is successful, we're now ready to pass the MX into the profile manager. To do this, call process profile in your profile manager, pass the profile name that you created in the EMDK profile manager, the profile manager set flag, and the third parameter being a new string, even though it can be null. So as you can see, the first parameter is enable Wi-Fi, which is the same as mine. So let's see what happens when I run this application on my Zebra TC51. As we can see on it, the Wi-Fi is currently disabled. So let's run it and see if it enables the Wi-Fi and connects to the right network. So it looks like it's run successfully. And as you can see, the Wi-Fi has now been enabled. And it's now connected to Zed Guest. Thank you for watching. Please make sure to check out the Zebra Developer Portal if you have any more further questions.